since I was little, I just have been around Ball State Volleyball along with Dave and John. It's just been uh, something that's been part of our life since we were very, very little. It all starts, obviously, with, with Dr. Don, uh, my father, who is pretty much the patriarch of volleyball in the state of Indiana and the Midwest, and even certainly extends out across the country to so many different spots. Well, I think Dave was a freshman when I was a senior, and he was the one that went around campus to all the sororities and fraternities and drummed up uh, fans to come to our matches. And when we played Ohio State when I was a junior and senior, we basically had six, 7,000 fans in Irving Gym. And a lot of that was in part to the fact that Dave had gone around all these fraternities and sororities and really promoted our team as a freshman. You know, Steve had a, had a great volleyball career at Ball State. Um, he, the teams were great when he was there. Um, they battled against Ohio State with some great Ohio State teams. That was uh, right around the peak of Ball State men's volleyball. In high school, we, we really felt like we were competing against each other because once we got into state tournament play, we always had to play each other right off the bat. People ask me, well, how does the Ball State Purdue thing compare to Central and Burris? And from that standpoint, the intensity, the focus from the community, the interest, um, it doesn't compare. Um, you know, we would have three or 4,000 people at the field house or in ball gym students going crazy, um, you know, it, it was, it was some, something very special. He's a, a great competitor, a great coach, but he just brings it out of his players a little bit different than I do. I'm, I guess I'm a little bit more laid back. Steve and I, I think philosophically are very similar, but we're two different breeds of cat. You know, I, I think our personalities are just different, but you know, everyone's different. Uh, Dave, is, he always has had a different demeanor. The difference is, is that, you know, growing through high school, you know, I learned everything from him. And now I think at the college level, there's a few things that he's, he's learning from me. Every week, you know, we're on the telephone and uh, they're still helping me. I'm, I've still got so much, you know, to learn. I've coached high school for 34 years and it's a totally different world in college. And those guys have been there to help me through all the ups and downs and they always will be. And that's something I really appreciate.